I'm with Running Mayor Vaughn Spencer. Congratulations, Vaughn, on your election last year. Thank you, John. Uh, you've got a lot of challenges ahead uh, in this well, city. Yeah, uh, you know, it, not too much has changed from when Tom was mayor and now I'm taking up the reins. We still have financial issues. Uh, you know, we still have uh, issues with clean and safe initiatives. And our school district is falling on taxes. You know, we, we need to create economic development and bring some jobs in. All right. Yeah. Which brings us to today's event with Dr. Jill Biden uh, and kind of this community college industry partnership that was the discussion today. Uh, what did you get out of today's event? Well, I got what I got out of today's event, John, is that there are companies who are willing to uh, hire uh, students who've gone through the RAC program. Uh, obviously, the stuff done here at the Smith Technology Center is really forward thinking, uh, and uh, there's it's creating opportunities. And uh, particularly interested in the connection with the school district and also RAC, uh, the one young man indicated he's graduated from Reading High this year, but has been involved right. in taking classes here at RAC. So, you know, that connection with our school district, with the community college, and also the partnership that has gone on uh, with Albright and Alvernia. We're fortunate, as mayor of the city of Reading, we're fortunate to have institutes of higher education who are willing to put uh, the time and effort and also uh, monies towards helping the city and helping citizens in the city further their education and also uh, job training. Of course, this is a whole issue dear, near and dear to your heart because you were a teacher That's at Reading High School. And, uh, you know, I often used to tell my students, you know, when you graduate from high school, you know, uh, we'd like for you to, to stay in our community, knowing that some people go on the armed forces or some people have to go to college outside of the area. But the idea was to make sure that there were opportunities for students to stay in Reading, an opportunity for employment and helping to develop the skills necessary, you know, to compete in this 21st century world. And that's the, the key thing, because so many of the jobs that are available right now demand high technical skills that's that correct. workers from the old economy don't have. That's right. And that's where community colleges like this come into play, isn't that's it? Right. That's correct. So, and you're absolutely right. Uh, it's, uh, it's a different, you know, you hear a lot of the older people talk and they talk about all the good jobs that used to be in their community. Well, a lot of those jobs were manufacturing types of jobs were related a lot to uh, textiles work. And, and t here it was a lot of textile That's jobs. Right. Now, the old knitting mills. Now those, those organizations and those enterprises have become more technically uh, computer driven and uh, you have to develop a workforce that's able to compete in that field. And companies who do that type of work, they look at what's happening as far as your school district, as far as the technology training that's going on in your area, and they use that as a means to determine whether or not they want to uh, build an operation or a plan. All right, well, thank you very much, Mayor.